You are about to experience the best in professional audio, lighting, DJ gear, special effects, and video. This is coverage of Winter NAM 2017. We are AGIProDJ.com. So this is a brand new uh, mixer from Zone. This is the Zone PX5. Um, so on every single channel here, I'll just kind of start from the top and, and walk you through it. So this is a performance-focused effects mixer. Um, so it does have the built-in Excite FX engine. Um, you know, brand new FX engine. So we didn't pull that from another mixer. It's built for this mixer, and it's it's very easy to use. Uh, the very top here, we've got our um, effects. Uh, switch so we can actually switch our auxiliary uh, auxiliary send to the internal effects engine. We can switch it to dual, which will send out of the uh, external effects um, and the internal effects at the same time. Um, and then we've got external mode, um, which this effects send will send out of only the external. So we've got our effects send on all five channels here. So it is a four plus one channel mixer, um, but we do have a send on everything. So even on the auxiliary. As we go down, we've got our input selection. We've got phono, USB, and line. Um, and then it goes to our gain stage, and then we've got our three band total kill EQ. Uh, below that, we've got our frequent or our filter selection. So it's very quick and easy just to assign your filter, um, and it will route it directly over to the uh, amazing zone filters here. So it is a four channel, but we've got the uh, extra channel here for our auxiliary is, is basically exactly the same on all of our channels here. So the only thing that we're missing is our fader. So even on our auxiliary input, we can switch to our mic input, USB, or line. Um, we've got our gain stage, three band, total kill EQ, um, directly down to our filter, and our effects send. So anything that you put into this channel, you can do um, exactly the same as all four channels here. So um, as we go over to our effects here, we can source this from either only our auxiliary, channels one through four, um, we also have our master or send mode, so we can just send it directly from the channel straight to our effects. Um, this can be set up just on a quick switch, so you don't have to go through any kind of menus. It's, everything is very easy and up front here, so we got a quick switch for pre or post fader effects. Uh, we've got our master fader booth, um, goes down to our uh, return to our filter. And on our filter, we do have the resonance uh, knob here, so we can go from mild to wild. And then it's quick, easy to uh, switch from high pass, band pass, low pass, and then our on and off for the filter at the bottom here. So uh, back to our effects section, we do have a lot of effects. We got uh, massive Q delay, PCM delay, filter delay, delay and reverb, uh, mod delay, tape echo, and it just goes on and on. So we've got a lot of built-in effects that you can use right out of the box. Um, as it goes down, we can quick and easy switch the beat of those effects. Uh, you can tap tempo or you can hold it for uh, auto BPM detection. Um, below that, we've got an uh, interval so you can uh, tweak your effects here. And then we have our delay um, decay. Um, and then we get down to our focus section. So this is going to uh, be frequency specific uh, to our effects. So if we're going to have it all the way to the top, um, it's going to be all the highs down to your lows. Um, for your effects section. Effects level, on and off. Um, we have the way that our uh, channel fader um, is selectable, same with our cross fader is uh, selectable down here. As you can see over at the side here, we've got our uh, Q-Mix headphone. We've got a quarter inch and an eighth inch uh, input on our uh, headphone stand here. Um, and this does, it's uh, tractor certified. So with the new tractor, we've got uh, version uh, 2.11 they came out with. We've got uh, tractor and then Ableton uh, can be linked with tractor also. So the cool thing about that is we got all four channels coming directly in um, on the uh, uh, USB internal sound card. Um, to tractor here, and then if you set up uh, Ableton, you could set that up on your auxiliary send um, and have still access on your master from Ableton to your effects, to your filters, everything. You just don't have the fader. Um, it also comes on on the backside uh, to X Link, which we can set up our uh, K2. So we'll have uh, complete control of all of your software with the K2 that will link directly into the backside of this mixer. So on our backside here, we've got our uh, microphone input on the auxiliary channel. We've got quarter inch line outputs, XLR. We've got quarter inch uh, insert section, quarter inch uh, booth outputs. We also have uh, phono and line inputs on uh, channels one through four. This can be set up on the backside. We've got a uh, USB or uh, line and phono switch that you can uh, toggle. 
Um, we've got our X-Link protocol that comes out so you can link up your K-Series controller, USB. We also have our MIDI sync output. So if you want to sync this up to external devices, keyboards, drum machines, you can uh, sync everything directly from the mixer here. Uh, we've got our effects end, it's quarter inch stereo effects end. And we've got our external um, effects return in quarter inch and then record outputs uh, via RCA. Thank you.